At Derivan, we're always looking for new colours. But last year, we found not just a new colour, but a new pigment. And what's really exciting about this, we don't often get new pigments developed nowadays, and especially not for artists. Yin Min Blue is its name, and it's a fantastic blue colour, as you can see. It was developed in the Oregon State University in the College of Science, kind of by mistake. I believe the guys were working on some electrical componentry and were mixing a whole lot of rare elements and actually came up with this bright blue pigment. The name Yin Min comes from some of the elements, the rare elements that go into making it up. Yttrium, indium and manganese. And hence the name Yin Min. So we made up a batch last year, just a, a trial batch and got it out to some of our testers and artists and they just raved about it. So we've just made up a new larger commercial trial on, uh, and that's just what's left of the pigment, um, on, the, on the real thing. So presently it's only available with the pigment being made in the lab, so it's, it's quite expensive. We're hoping down the track in a few years that it'll come down to a reasonable price. But the reason it's still worth looking at, even though it's, it's up there in price, is because it sits right in the middle between the usual blues that we're used to, being, say, thalo blue, a green blue, and ultra blue, a very red blue. The Yin Min sits right in the middle. So it's a great mid-blue, terrific for mixing. Another interesting point about Yin Min is that Theoretically anyway, it is extremely inert and so should be very long lasting, light fast and permanent. Yin Min Blue, look for it in our Matisse structure range.